Previously on Alan Wake, I'm hunted by the law. Sheriff, Wake's running. I'm giving chase. Are you seriously telling me that writer just took out my deputies? A thriller I supposedly wrote is coming true. The genre of the story seems to be shifting. <sighs> it's turning into a horror story. I was told that Alice had been kidnapped, but that was a lie. We don't have his wife. We don't know where she is. Her purported kidnapper was eaten up by the dark presence before it attacked me. On to episode four we go. Alan, shh, baby. It was just a nightmare. Alice. There you are. Hartman, I fell. I had to give you a sedative. Don't fight it. I... You went through another rough period. What? Right now, it's very important that you stay calm. We don't want you to have another episode. You're a patient at my clinic. Have been for a while now. The shock of your wife's death triggered a mental illness. No, you're you lie. You're suffering from various symptoms of undifferentiated schizophrenia. Alice. It's okay, okay Alan. Just let go. Go, 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 go. <sighs> Alright. So we've apparently been wait here for a while. For to believe we're having schizophrenia. Now the question is, how long have I been here? Hey, Lucid. Groggy. Whatever Hartman had bumped in me was making me numb. I felt like this was happening to someone else, someone I was watching on television. I couldn't think, couldn't focus. There were only empty sheets of paper. Damn, here. that chapter no manuscript pages. What it was tap it. Damn that chapter. Right. Uh, f speaking of Alan Woke, he just woke up. <laughs> Good evening, Alan. Are we feeling better now? Feeling calm? Yeah. I see you brought your pet gorilla with you. So sure, I'm calm. I get the message. Loud and clear. Quite right. That's the spirit? You're being very brave, Alan. I understand you're confused. I would be more concerned if you weren't suspicious of me. I don't blame you for it. Big of you. Now, why don't you come with me? We'll reacquaint you with my clinic and go over everything you might have forgotten. Little walk and some fresh air? Yes, it will do you good. For a guy who's claiming I was here for a while, his nose is still freshly this hurt is for me. Patients. Punching Most him. Most of them aren't here right now. Jack took them out for a fishing trip. Except for the ones who are particularly vulnerable. 360 in the game. Encourage sorry. creativity. Sorry, sorry, part sorry. Of the recovery process here at Cauldron Lake Lodge. I specialize in treating artists. I bet you do. Splendid, Alan. I honestly believe we can get this thing under control if we work together. This way, Alan. I'm gonna get some claustrophobic shit going on right now. I'm not happy with this idea. Now, Alan, from past experience with you, I know I need to get right into the heart of the matter as quickly as I can after an episode. So I'm just going to say this. Alice is dead. No. You're in a very vulnerable state until you understand and accept this. Alice drowned. And you couldn't face that. You're suffering from hallucinations, paranoid delusions, unusual thinking, an obsession about light and darkness, a feeling that everything revolves around you, your thoughts and dreams. Your mind has constructed an elaborate fantasy scenario in which your writings are affecting reality. She has been kidnapped and supernatural forces of darkness are trying to stop you. I mean, when you put it like that. Go this way, Alan. I wasn't ready for another shot, so I went along with it. He had to be lying, but under the influence of the drug he had given me, I had to fight not to believe his words. It's all in your head. You've been making it up. Apart from the tragic accident with your wife, no one has been killed. Your delusions are just a manifestation of your subconscious mind trying to protect you from the too painful truth. Unless we fight the fantasy, it will return. 
I know the so I just keep rattling for 60. Think about it. Doesn't this make far more sense than the insane supernatural conspiracy you have concocted in your mind? You're a skeptic by nature, Alan. We both know this. Everything can be explained logically. Yeah. Jump on it. Look how I jump. Well, there's a lake. And there is no house in the middle of the lake. I never get tired of this view. Very inspiring, isn't it? Cauldron Lake spread below us. I could see Mira Peak on the other side of the lake. I thought I could make out the spot where Diver's Isle had been when I arrived with Alice. Now there was nothing but waves. It seems there's a storm coming. Funny, I don't recall there being a mention of that in the weather forecast. Well, no matter. This it's supernatural forces! Alan, what I'm telling you is good news. Right now we're in control. Every time you have a relapse, it gets more and more difficult to resurface from the dark depths of your imagination. Not surprising, considering your profession. Imagination is what you work with. After all your nightmares, this should come as an immense relief to you. If it doesn't, why is that? Because I'm lying? Or because you don't want to admit that you're not well? It's very natural for you to think of me as your enemy. It's part of the illness. I let him talk. Hartman obviously loved his own voice. His words echoed madly inside my head. I dug my nails into the palms of my hands to stay focused. You need to work <laughs> Sound of his own voice. That, we can begin the journey towards your recovery. I think his intentions are, of you know, genuine. He wants to help. He just doesn't realize the situation. Uh, here's the entrance to the office wing. That's for staff only. You were impressed by my trophies when you first arrived here. I do love to hunt. The great outdoors, man versus nature. It's wonderful stuff. Okay, then. Pretty damn wonderful, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. I got you. I'm a real bad dream, mister. You should be afraid of me. Don't want to run into me in the night, that's for sure. Please, Emerson. Mr. Wake is confused enough as it is. Yeah, you'd like me to go away so you won't be scared. But you can't just decide what kind of dream you have or when you have it. Emerson. Okay, okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Rude. Oh, there's the bear. Oh, look at my phone. I have not been picking these up. Come, Alan, this way. Now, you might have noticed the typewriter in your room. You've been writing as a part of the therapy. As soon as you feel up to it, you should continue. Please ask friends and family to schedule visits before you to ensure they don't feel your therapy and all periods of creativity. Please respect your parents. Fellow patients need to prove in personal space, especially when they're engaged by their creative processes. Typically, our patients have long-term creative problems, and they won't be solved overnight. Give yourself permission to take the time you need. Bear in mind that you're voluntarily receiving therapy treatment that's specifically tailored for you. Engagement therapy and a system method. The flow work best when you're actively engaged in shaping them. If you have any concerns, you can ask to voice them. Okay, then. My rheumatism's killing me. There's a storm coming. Oh! What a storm! I hope it wipes this place off the face of the earth. And these two are the Anderson brothers, Odin <laughs> and Tor. They had a... how could I put this? A heavy metal band in the 70s and 80s called Old Gods of Asgard. They even adopted new first names to complete the image of Viking gods. After the band broke up, they lived on a farm nearby. They are, well, in advanced stages of dementia. They are well cared for, TLC and all that. There's nothing more that can be done. I'm afraid that the rock and roll lifestyle has left its mark. Those two are kick ass. I love these two oh, characters. Alan. I'm so sorry to cut this short for now, Alan. The power has been acting up. I'd better go check on it. We'll continue this soon. Meanwhile, when you feel up in the background, turn to your room and try to write. It really is for the best. Oh, do you mean the old dudes? 
We're in a mental health asylum, an asylum place right now. I'd like to bash his head in with a hammer. Oh, he loved to fish out our secrets, but he has no clue. He's not crazy enough. <laughs> not crazy like us, Sonny. <laughs> <laughs> He's crazy as a requirement, Sonny. Who else could understand the world when it's like this? It takes crazy to know crazy. That's the sanest thing I've heard in a while. <laughs> Say, you're all right, Tom. Hey, we like him, don't we, bro? He's got to go to the farm. The Anderson farm. <laughs> Valhalla! We wrote it all down, lest we forget. A crash course. All you need to know to get your head right. You need to find the message. Here, Sonny, here's something for you. Gave me a rash. But I kept it safe from these bastards. My head was clearing up, or according to Hartman, I was sinking back into the fantasy. I was convinced he was lying to me about everything. Crazy or not, the Andersons made more sense. There's guys that play puppets. Yeah, uh, no. <laughs> We Sorry, have guys. a stash of the special stuff at the farm. Our own formula. Local ingredients. Medicine <laughs> clears your head right up. Makes you remember like moonbeams on the brain. Oh, I just noticed leather patches on the elbows. That's not very rock and roll. Tom hey, that shit looks cool. Baba Yaga got to him too. The <laughs> oh my god. Taken from all of us. Took my thunder, the witch. So and many references about going on here. What were they? Memory and thought. The hag. She took something from you too, didn't she? That's what she does. Um, we're better off. This place, the lake, it gives you power. If you're a creator, an artist, a god. I miss shifted in their sleep in the darkness of the lake. <laughs> yeah, that's the one. She makes sure it comes out twisted and wrong. Just ask the lamp lady. She knows what happened to that other rider. She's been using you, boy. And you let her. You went and opened the door for her, didn't you? Now, now, it was already open a crack. And whose fault is that? We're morally corrupt, disease-ridden, old and stupid. Doesn't mean he had to open it all the way, goddammit. Ah, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> so tired. Built the farm close to the lake. A place of power. We had parties there, man. You... You should go there and have a party. I think we're heading to the farm. Fat Bob Balder threw the amp through the window. Hit that a hippie chick in the back of the <laughs> head. Fifteen stitches of a concussion. Oh, no. <laughs> Bob's dead now. Leukemia. Stitches, snitches, and narcs, man. Bad scene. I am tired, man. So tired. Okay, they're still going. Is that it? I, I, uh, I want to go home. Is this where I break them out and let them go home? I don't, I don't know. That seems like a really ill-advised thing to do. Uh, anyway, the the piece of lore I guess I know about these guys is the band there in the old gods gods of Asgard um, Poets of the Fool actually wrote songs for this game under that synonym or whatever that fucking word is I can't remember now but yeah under that name uh, just so they could just so that they would have songs in the game <laughs> supposedly done by these guys so they have like a, a little album that's called Old Gods of Asgard but it's actually by Poets Okay, return to your room. Where the heck was my room? Patient yeah, room. Good thing he's not overreacting or anything. 
Well, who's the boss? I may need a hand here later on, Bird. The storm's down to those emails being jumpy. You know how those are. Gotcha. Doc's got me looking after way too many questions. I'll handle this from down here. I'll do that, Bird. Okay. Something's wrong. Hartman had mentioned that the power had been acting up. Maybe that was the reason for the generator and the work light on the balcony. The generator hadn't been activated, and there was no key. I'm trapping this cabin. Have been for days, but it's always dark outside. My editor is real. I saw her again. She's not human. It's not human. A dark presence is wearing the old woman's face. She was covered in clinging shadows. There's a hole in her chest where her heart should be. I think I've made a horrible mistake. I don't think I'm any closer to saving Alice. It's been lying to me, using me to get the story it wants, and the story will come true. Oh snap! Wait, what the? What? I've never noticed that before. And I don't have like my phone isn't equipped to scan it right now. Oh damn! I gotta come back now and scan it and see where, the f where it sends me. Okay, I'm gonna get to my room. No, okay, wrong way. This way. Hey, Hartman wait. wanted me to write. I knew I couldn't, but I figured I should just out, play huh? along for now. It was room. the only thing I could do with Nurse Birch watching me like a hawk. Yeah. Nosing around other people's rooms. It's all good. Okay. The white glare of the page in front of me hurt my eyes. My hands began to shake uncontrollably. Everybody calm down. Put that down. Hey, wake. You stay here. I'm gonna go see what's up. You just keep doing what you're doing. Be cool, okay? I didn't know what the chaos was all about, but it could be my only chance of getting out of here. Where the hell did you get a dare? Well, I don't know. Sinclair looked bad. That wasn't a love tap. The crazy old fart hit her hard. If she was one of Hartman's goons, she had it coming. Destiny. I could get the key to the office room from Sinclair. I had to get to Hartman's office. He had taken all my manuscript pages. That's where he'd be keeping them. I think. Maybe you could come out and beat our wrinkled adult diapered ass, Bert. Since you're so tough, Bert. Can I like talk to them? We were on the road, man. You think we haven't seen pups like you before? Oh, here we go. That is. The markings on the tape said they were recordings Hartman had made of the sessions with his patients. I saw Alice's name on one of them. For a moment, I couldn't believe it. Right. Now, Mrs. Wake. Tell me about Alan's problems. He's more and more out of control all the time. The parties, he's so angry all the time. He's getting violent and he's... Do you mean with you? No, not with me. No, never. I... Sometimes I almost wish Alan would take a swing at me. Because at least that'd lead to a conversation he couldn't just march out of. But no. He just... Yeah, 
Hold up. What she was saying made me happy and sick and guilty all at once. Worst of all, I recognized the words. The phone call from her. It had been a cut up of this. Just a recording. Okay. Um, so I noticed that a lot of these paintings that someone else has obviously done uh, match some of the stuff that we've been seeing. Which is uh, concerning. Okay. Is that just going to replay or is that something else? Oh, different. He was completely blocked, and frankly, I was about to discard him as useless. However, once Wake arrived and started writing, something changed in Rudolph. He's producing extraordinary work. Oh, he's so he's the artist. Pieces. Unfortunately, he doesn't respond to direction at all, and it's my belief that he's not so much a creator as an illustrator, perhaps a recorder of sorts. Considered the existence of such a role before, let alone its implications, but the paintings he has produced are informative. At least he's easily controlled and useful. I wish I could say the same about Wake. It's frustrating that the best subjects are always so damn difficult to deal with. Anything else? Property, and I will not allow you to disturb my patients. Yeah, I can get a warrant. How are your fragile little patients like that? <laughs> oh, I'm thoroughly intimidated by your mighty authority now, Agent. Listen, you smug snob. How would you like it if I busted through this gate and knocked you around a little? Agent Nightingale, first of all, I'm recording this conversation, so you might want to watch what you say. Secondly, you're not dealing with a hick now. I know the law, and if you can get a judge to grant a warrant, I'll be glad to cooperate. But you won't get one. Be advised that any further communications with me are to be made through my lawyer. I don't believe this. Good day, Agent. Yeah. <laughs> wow. He's such a dick, that Agent, dude. Let her out of here! Arthur, do you hear me? I'm gonna sue your crazy quack ass to shreds! Seriously! Barry? You Ow! About time! Barry! Man, am I glad to see you. We need to get to Hartman's office. It's right next door. You okay? Yeah. I mean, no! These were all the pages I had already. And more. Alan, please. You're sliding back into the... Tell me one more lie and I'll shoot you in the face. Ah, well, it was worth a shot. Really, Wake, come on. Let's work together on this. You have no idea... Hartman, what... shut up! Barry, get out of here. I'll catch up with you. Get a car. Oh, Al, let's just... Go! <laughs> Wake, listen to me. This is a mistake. Don't you see? Together we can create something absolutely wonderful with your ability and mine. Oh snap. Oh snap. Was he smiling there? Or is that just like really bad animation? I needed a fucking flashlight. Is there a flash? Oh god. What what are you do? Open the lock. What's he do? 
Wh why is he not opening it? Are you... Uh, oh. Why didn't it do that before? What the... F oh, Lord. That's not good. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna run. Ah. That's what I'm doing. Ah, God, I'm messing up. Hi, Darkness, how you doing? Let's just slowly go through all the furniture. Okay. Let's just go do this. Okay, let's Where's there another generator somewhere I can use? Maybe I start that to distract the furniture, and then I have to run outside, I think. Because Barry's supposed to be waiting outside with the car. So maybe, yeah, that clears the path of the door. Okay, I see. Okay. Wait, grab the fucking flare. Thank you. Gonna need it. Pause on my uh, running. Grab yeah, that very important manuscript. <laughs> Shazer. Attack me? What you gonna do? Run! 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 Run, Alan, run! Run, 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 you little... Oh my god. Oh god. This isn't good, this isn't good, this isn't good, this isn't good, this isn't good. I have to get him to break that door down, I think. I assume. I have a gun, I don't actually have any bullets on it. It does have a long rest time. I need it and I start moving it towards it, it was gonna do it. Hooey! Wait, run! Okay, so I can't get out that way. Can I get out? No? Okay. So I need to. Okay, let's go in here. Run, 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 run. 
Okay, that's nice. I don't think I can get out. I found the car, but the gate's locked. You're gonna have to go through the hedge maze over there. Barry, I don't have a light. Take this, Al. Oh God! Look at the house, Al. Look out! Oh snap! Let me go, let me go, let me go, Oh dear. Yeah, yeah, I'm working on it. Alright. Oh god, I hate this bit. I hate this bit so much. I died so many times doing this bit. Yeah, I can hear him too. Oh god! That's right, now I remember. This is why I hate the maze. Okay. Right. Okay. I hear you. I know that there's one of you out there. I mean, there's always one of you out there, you fuckers. Yeah, I, I figured. What? That was the wrong way to go. What are you doing? Oh god, that's a dead end. I meant to dodge that. Oh, fuck. Really? Can you just, like, die? Thank you. <laughs> Wait, I uh, wish way. Random ammo lying around the flat floor, it's all good. Hi, Harmon, how you doing? Oh, oh, it's him. Oh, you. No. I'm not okay with that. Oh my god, how much darkness- Ah! You birds. Fuck us, piss off. Yeah, that's right. Oh my god, I don't have anything to help me against those things. This is your average everyday darkness. This is advanced darkness. <laughs> Fucking birds. I hate the birds so much. Darkness go, darkness go, darkness go, darkness go. Oh my god. Fuck you, burps.
Oh, that wasn't him. Okay. Oh, fuck. Finally. How many bullets do you take? Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna go up there because there's a box. I need to get that box because it's gonna have stuff in it. Oh, God, here we go. It's all good. We did the thing. Oh, that would have been useful when, you know. They were... Oh, shit, there's tons of them coming. You fuckers snuck up on me, didn't you? This is not a good spot to be in. Did you just use my. Fuck's sake, I probably needed that. Can you, like. I can't believe I was wasting my flag gun on that guy. That's frustrating. Oh, the coffee doesn't restore health. It's like a. a. a uh, da, 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 da. just a collectible thing. If you collect them, you get an achievement sort of thing. I've never actually done it, so. Oh. This is the thing that restores my health. Going in the light. Ah, lovely. That'll be lovely. Give me a shotgun. How much have I got? My shotgun. Not much, okay. Oh, this is gonna be some fun times. I can just feel it. Worst coffee ever. <laughs> yeah, it's been sitting there for ages as well in the game, so you know, God knows how cold it is. Okay, that's, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Can I get some flashbangs? I'd love some flashbangs. Can I, can I get through? Thank you. Fuck your wool bow. I gotta get that light, I gotta get that light! Ah! Alright, it's all good. Screw you. Screw you and your fucking wheelbarrow. Oh, boy. Water, that can't get, that can't be good. Alright. I can't remember, I just uh, go through. No, I have to go. I am meant to go through the bridge, but there's a cash here. <laughs> Give me that good. Oh my god! Drop! Flashbang! Flare! Thank you! Do you mind? I was tr minding my own business and then you fuckers turned up. God damn it. I was actually immediately lose a flare I just grabbed. God damn. Spooky wubow. Uh, wait, is that just the way forward as well? No, that's just a cache, isn't it? Hmm. If it is the way forward, then that might explain why they came for me. No, it's not. I have to go to that bridge there, I assume. From somewhere. Aha, some stairs. Yes, yes, some stairs. You can fuck right off, crows. I ain't having none of that. It's too easy. It's not gonna work.
get out of here. Can you open this gate? Maybe. Barry. Uh, well, I slammed it shut when the nasty showed up, and the key fits kind of loose in the lock, so, uh... Oh, fuck me. Oh shit. This ain't good. Oh, this ain't good. Oh, this ain't good. Let's just do that down. Okay. Who oh, got? Oh my god, are you serious? Okay, fine. Oh my god, you're fucking massive and you're fucking killing me. Ah! I'm dead. Okay. How many of them were there? Oh, I'm not okay with this. Okay, so. Oh, well. I found it. I found it. That's nice. Oh my god, what? I fucking shot you. Woo! I didn't know I could do that mover. Do I not have a fucking. Oh god, I'm dead. Okay. Ugh. Oh. I feel like I'm wasting my flares too soon, but I don't know what to do. Okay, good. Oh, you're dead. You're, you're, you're coming. You're done. Fuck. What I gotta do is get out of there. Get out of my way. Out of my way. Please tell me we're headed for the nearest. You're now leaving Bright Falls. Come back soon, sign. We're going to the Anderson farm. I knew you were gonna say something like that. You know what? You owe me big time for this. When this is through, <laughs> if we make it, I don't care what anybody says, I'm done with darkness. You're gonna buy me a tanning bed as a gift, and I'm gonna live in it. <laughs> I love Barry. <laughs> the car will come himself in the car, yeah, I know, it's great. Found your own coffee? Oh no. I'm crazy, but that's fine, Barry. <laughs> oh, you got that right, Al. You're barking mad. You are by far the craziest. But maybe that's inevitable when you deal with crazy stuff like this. It helps. This is happening, Barry. Alice. They never had Alice. She's trapped in the darkness at the bottom of the lake, but she's not dead. Ow. 
How can you know that? I know, Barry. I can... How? I... No, listen. I can bring her back. I can find her. There's something special about this place. The lake, it, it does something to the works of art created here. It makes them come true. But there's a catch. The dark presence, whatever that thing is, twists it to its own ends. That's why all of this is happening. It's using my manuscript to take over everything. Al, I believe you. It happened to Thomas Zane before. It happened to the Andersons. I believe you. Crazy or not, you're not delusional. Weird shit's going down. That's a fact. I'm on board, man. I'm with you. The Andersons knew about it, but they were too far gone to tell me with all the drugs they were on. But they wrote it down. There's a message somewhere at their farm, Barry. We just need to find it. Look out! Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Uh oh. I hope you're wearing your seatbelt. I'm getting bleppy cuddles. <laughs> oh, snap. I had lost my gun in the crash. Barry was nowhere to be seen. Barry! Barry! Oh, you walked off that ankle that ankle break real easily, didn't you? But the ground gave way. Man, what a drop. Don't worry, your cutout is fine. Are you okay? I hit some bushes, didn't get a scratch. There's no way you can climb down though. It's like a sheer wall. Help! There's something moving down here! Barry, it's a taken! Use a flare, Barry! Barry, are you all right? <laughs> I'm good, Al. I'm great. Guess you never messed with anyone from New York City before, huh? He wrote himself to have a major return of powers, yeah. I'll be waiting. Barry, just wait for me, okay? Al, I'm not staying here. It's suicide. I'm going to the farm. I'm going to go ahead and secure the area. You can catch up. Don't worry about it. I'm on the case. Now he's Rambo. <laughs> turn into a disaster if I didn't catch up with Barry. Alright. Oh, fuck you, birds. I hate the birds. I better not have to do more parkour shit with this awkward over the shoulder view. Uh. Oh, that ain't good. That ain't good. Oh shit. Oh shit. Can you not, Darkness? Can you? Oh my god. Can you get under the cover or not? No? Okay. There's a Kai Vermis. Fuck you, Barrow. I need this. Fuck all your Barrows. Eh, 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 eh. Of course something else is coming to life. Why wouldn't more things come to life? Ow. Ow. Oh, I actually dodged that somehow. Okay. I'm not going to constantly dodge now, okay? To avoid the fucking things that have been thrown at me. Let's do it this way. Can't go wrong. Light. Light. I need your light. I need your light. I don't have any lightness. I'm already figuring it out. I'm figuring it out. Hello, Paige. Hello, Generator. That's conveniently placed. <gasps> have a lantern? Aww. That'd be so cool in old school if I could have a lantern. I wasn't doing it for a second. There you go. Okay. I could sense the movement in the woods ahead. Facing the enemy without a weapon was dangerous, but I had no choice. 
Trust no one in the woods. Yeah, got that one. We're boned. We are so goddamn boned. Okay. So why don't you have that scene in Indigo Prophecy where a guy is in time for the attacks and wasted by a small shed. Okay. Okay. What can go wrong, yeah? Let's just... Oh dear, that's what can go wrong. Oh my god. You didn't even give me a chance to fucking think about it. Start. Oh my god. Fucking just run. Just run, just run, just run. Fuck the thing, fuck the thing, fuck the thing. We're running, we're running, we're running, we're running, we're running, we're running, we're running. There's light there. We're running. We're just doing it, we're just doing it, we're just doing it, we're just doing it, we're just doing it. We're just running. Oh my god. What the? Don't get stuck on the fucking stairs, you twat. Light. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. When you walk into the light, there's no more things to kill you. That's, that's literally the rules of the game. <laughs> a car was driving away from the farm, <laughs> headed in the same general direction as I was. For all I knew, it was Barry, caught in the consequences of leaping before booking it. Yeah, Barry's probably gonna die. I don't know. I can't remember actually if he dies in this game or not. Oh, yes, let's do that. That's much better. Okay. Some. Lithium batteries, because you have to be specific about the type of batteries. Can I, can I get anything in here? Well, you don't go camping without a gun? God damn it. It's America. You always go camping with a gun. The car was heading for the cabin up ahead. It wasn't far. If it was Barry, I would see the damage soon. Screw you. Okay. Ow. Ha what? I'm trying to deliver each page to the right time and place. I'm trying to show you how the story goes. I had seen glimpses like lightning. I had seen it in my dream. It was a strange spaceman or a diver in a bulky suit. He was the one who'd been placing the pages on my path. Oh, fuck, more bear traps. With that shit. The trapper's playing now. God damn it, trapper. I was trying to fuck with our shit. We want to do this, and we want to do it fast. In a second, I also probably want to pick up the shotgun first. Pick it up. Oh. Someone had left a gun behind. Now I had a fighting chance of reaching the farm. Ah, oh, look at the look at this conveniently placed shotgun and ammo. Game logic. Oh, do I need to climb? Are you getting there somehow? Oh no. No, not possible. Okay. I think it, I think there might be another stash if I figure out how to get in there though. Oh, the stairs right there. I can see. Am I about to do what? I'm not doing that. I'm not. I refuse to do the falling down thing again. If it does, then I'm gonna be really angry with it. Oh, there's one there. Okay. That yeah, was me thinking there'd be something cool up here. Okay. Well, I know where we're going. Ah, oh, there we go. That looks like a path ahead there. Uh, okay. I see someone got the ban hammer. I don't know what happened. But thank you, mods. 
Game, where am I going? That's the way to the cavern, right? But apparently I'm going this way. Okay, we're going this way. I see now. Not always clear. No, wait, this is the way we came from, isn't it? Yeah. Wait, oh, 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 I see. We're going this way. Okay, yeah, we're going the right way. The music's doing its thing. Yeah, we're, we're going the right way. We got people, we got enemies spawning. Do you mind, Huntress? Huntresses today. Okay. Da 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 da. See the light up ahead. Jesus Christ! I almost didn't fucking see it. Do you mind? Do you mind? I don't. I don't appreciate you. Oh my! Yeah, I know. Okay. Well, at least I know which way to go now, so I can avoid. Running around hopelessly. Thing is, I'm also trying to avoid stepping in these things. Hopelessly. Wait, did I grab my shit? Did I grab my shit before I did this? I think I did. I gotta grab my shit, go away! I gotta grab my gun! Just like splay across it to distract them all. Oh my god, are you serious? I've missed you like twice. sake. I don't I got it. Well, thank you, I guess. Do you mind? Thank you. Okay. 
I only have two bullets left. And I'm out of batteries. Oh, fuck. Okay, it's time to run. Because we are not equipped to do anything else. Nope, nope. Oh god, we're gonna die, we're gonna die, we're gonna die, we're gonna die. That's it, we're dead, okay. Wait, where are... Okay. Let's get this Someone had left first. Now I had a fighting chance of reaching the farm. Was there not uh, more batteries? They really not give me any more batteries. Okay. Have to be more careful about this. I'm more reserving with it. Focus on still moving forward. There's gonna be more that'll turn up here. Really? Oh yeah, there they are. I can see the car, but there okay. was no sight of the driver. For all that, I just had to run for the Resident Evil 2 remake is out in two days. You should stream if you want to get it. Yeah, I'm, I'm hoping to, because two days is payday, so I can buy it. Hello? Anybody here? Ah! Oh. Barry! Don't mind me, I'm just gonna grab shit while you're, like, screaming and dying. Front door was locked. You thank you. I know you. You were in jail the other day. I went to the farm again. Shine, you know, it makes you see they're, they're not gonna miss it. They're in the loony bin. But my buddy Danny, I lost him. Something's gone wrong with him. It's not him. Like a real bad follow up to a real good movie. The best friend. Why, you're welcome. It was indeed me. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. I've run through every possible course in my head. If I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. It's a horror story, but it's going to kill her, and me, and everybody in this town. No one will survive. Darkness will consume everything. This is what it's wanted all along. It will be free, unstoppable. It used Alice to get to me, dangled her in front of me to keep me going. It was never going to release her. I'm going to change this. I'll escape. I've written myself into the story. I'm now the protagonist. This feels like a terrible risk, but it's the only way to save Alice. I'll be bound by the events of the story just as much as anyone else who's been woven into it. The story must stay true for this to work. There have to be victims along the way. Near escapes. Cliffhangers. 
In a horror story, it can't be certain that the hero will succeed or even survive. He almost has to die. I'll write my own escape into the story next. I need help. Zane's going to be the one who will help me. I'll make it happen. Ooh. Zany boy. Uh, so for those who missed the first half, hi there. Die? Thank you. Why am I using my revolver for this? Oh well. Okay. Let me guess. Danny, huh? Uh, so the um. Thomas Zane, who's been referenced a few times now already, is a... was a... someone who used to write? Yeah, he was a previous author or artist uh, back, way back in the past, and... he was... T he and his girlfriend Cynthia Weaver got unstuck with the darkness, and I'm pretty certain the darkness is wearing Cynthia's face. That's as far as I've gotten. Because keep in mind, although I'm replaying this, I haven't actually finished this game yet, so I'm getting to, I'm getting to the point now that I've played up to. Because uh, I remember doing this episode, and then after that, I don't remember. So I'm pretty sure we're about to we're starting to- oh god! Reach the points that I got up to. I can't drive. I can't drive in real life and I cannot drive in a game. Stop. He's on. Let's check this house out. It's not a bad idea. There are so many darkness people in here, aren't there? Bad abbies. I need that shit. Ooh. Another cash. Flashbangs! 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 There's someone upstairs, I can hear him. Well, it feels like there is. Can I... Can I not go up here? What? No? Okay, there's nothing up here. Okay. Well, forget it as well. Check him. Manly grunt! As I fall off the stairs! Alright. What the hell did I bump on that time? Right, which way to the farm? Uh, I'm gonna see this way. That doesn't look so good. Gone. Oh, now I have to do this way for okay. Good thing I took care of those guys on feet on the in the car. <sighs> first things first. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not cool, not cool, darkness, not cool, not cool, not cool, not cool, not cool, not cool. Ugh, I fucking hit shift as well. What, what, what's with hitting shift to... I'm not actually...
Do I just have to time this? There we go. Jesus, I used a lot of batteries. I probably could have tried to like time and run through it. I don't know. That was probably the smarter thing to do. That's done. So if I use this, this isn't a bad idea. Ah, uh, I am remembering. Oh, I am remembering. I am going to die a lot. Because this took me forever to do. I'd known the brothers used to be some kind of rock stars, but it hadn't really sunk in until I saw the stage. Oh, you got a little bit of post of the four in the background. Oh, oh my god. Okay. Come on. Do you mind? I'm busy. Go over here, you. Ooh. Let me switch over to the heavy duty. Shit. I can't. Let's do any of them. Let me switch to this! Get, get out of my face! Oh my god! Let me switch- Will you fuck off? That's right, I want you to fuck off. Hold. Thank you! If I die right now, I'll be so pissed. Don't you fucking die. He's got this fucking thing. Do you mind? Well, now I know that they're um, heavy duties right there. Oh! Oh, it doesn't like completely erase it, okay. Okay, so it accepted that I got halfway and let me do it. Oh, that was a waste of a bullet.
Do I? Do I? Do I? Do I, do I, do I Okay. Now we get to the hard bit. Because that was not the hard bit. <laughs> that was awesome! Bright Falls, Rock and Roll Capital of America. Okay, ba batteries. What about the batteries then? Come on, come on, focus on the batteries. I don't care about the roll armor. Yeah, the, the batteries. The, the batteries game. I want the battery. Oh, okay, apparently I have that there on that as well. Yeah. Okay. I didn't realize this was here either. Hey, Al! This way to the farm! Okay. Yeah. It would have been useful to have realized that was there as well. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna die. Poets of the Fall, fuck yeah. Hi there, random cutout of Alan Wake. No reason to worry. Your cutout's good as new. Oh my right? fucking well, god. I'll come back for it once we have the place secured. Yeah, that's been my biggest worry all this time. We need to get this thing moved out of the way. This is as far as I got before they ambushed me. in the cutout. No, my life will never go on without that cutout. That I I I jumped. I want to own for the record. I hit the jump bar. The jump bar. The space bar. Are you, are you serious? I can't even go along that wooden beam. Okay. Okay. Fine. You know, register. I wanted to jump this time then. I love this game, but sometimes are the mechanics. Yeah. Okay. We'll leave. Hey, I think Alan Wake here has something to say. Uh, what's that, Al? Ooh, I'm Alan Wake. I'm always right about everything. And if I don't get my way, I'm sorry all day long. I'm always inventing. Woody, it makes me very distracting. Here he is. <laughs> oh my god, I can focus on it. I see what you did there. Yeah, it was pretty good. You want me to do my imitation of Barry Wheeler? No? Mm. Thought so. <laughs> <laughs> wow! <laughs> you mean look at that thing, Al? They really went all out with this Viking crap, didn't they? Sleep. We all spend uh -oh, a few hours night in spring. the soft Okay. How do I get out of here? Page. The Viking boat looked imposing, almost like a battering ram. I don't think the darkness appreciated that. No, the darkness definitely didn't appreciate that. Okay, I've got my heavy duty flashlight and shotgun now, bitch. Oh god, hi there! Shut up. I don't even have to focus if I can get shit done. We make sure he has his clothes on when he goes out in public. Okay. 
Oh god, it's one of these guys, okay. So I'm gonna fucking slide over the place. I need to remember to reload. I think we can make it through here, Al. Pretty sure I just have to time it, right? I just throw two down backs then. I think I did. Oh well. Okay, can't be able to wait for this. So bright, can't see anything. Wow, those geezers had quite a production going on. Ooh, you know what, Al? If we make it through this alive, I'm gonna start representing them. Yep, sell this stuff online, maybe get a reality show going, release a new single. Good luck with that, pal. Hey, you find us a way out of here, okay? I'm gonna take a closer look at this stuff. <laughs> Barry's gonna get drunk. I mean, you're the one who's getting drunk. At least I'm gonna have a sense of balance. Nope. I get bad none of that. Good with this okay. shotgun, am I? Yeah. Are you fucking gonna jump out at me again? No? Okay, good. I can only handle that one once. Mm -hmm. I already have a heavy duty lamb. What's the difference? Oh, I see. I can get batteries. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. As you regular listeners know, I tend to work through the night. I'm not the only one. Deputies Mulligan and Thornton are taking a couple of moments off their busy schedule to join me here in the studio. Boys, how busy are you now? Just right, Barry's. <laughs> We can't talk about that. I wasn't gonna say anything. Same we got, you know. The eye is the problem. And I need to go there. They don't seem relatively peaceful to me, but people do tend to get a little wild this time. So I was listening to the. 
is into this. I could see the building that had to be the Anderson's home on the other side of the lake. It wasn't far now. I wasn't worried about trusting the ramblings of two burned out geriatric wrecks. They had the goods. They had the goods. <laughs> Look at him running around just kicking shit. So much respect for their property. Well, let's pick up. Something else. Wow, what the hell just happened? Thanks for the follow, Marlboro. Marlboro? That's. That just made me think of cigarettes. <laughs> Sorry. Oh no, this is gonna be good. I want that box of goodies. Oh, I just remembered why I have that box of goodies. Oh, this is where I die lots. This is where I die lots. Alright. Oh no! Oh no. This is where I die lots. Yep, that's where I died. Okay, okay, okay. That's where I died. Does that mean Alan is making Barry annoy him? Probably. I suppose he just wanted to write Barry authentically. Right. Okay. Oh, I hate this man. Hi there, buddy. How you doing? Move, 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 move. Okay. Okay. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. Defeat the harvest. Yeah, just defeat the harvest. Out of the way. Out of the way. Out of the way. Out of the way. Oh fuck, you guys are here still. Forgot about that. I still have a lot of flashbangs hanging around. Fuck. Oh no! Oh, oh no! Oh fucking hell. If I, I didn't fight one of these, no, I fought a. I fought a car. Not a harvester. Be prepared to watch a lot of dying, by the way. It took me a good, like, hour to beat this the first time round, and I don't have memory anymore. Can you not stop for this? Can you just, like, run away? That would be easier. That would be much, much easier for everybody involved. Can I just... Can I shoot? Thank you. Hoi! Oh god. Of course I need to serve that. Okay, take some light from that. Yeah, take the flare. about you buddy. Honestly do not care. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck me. Oh god. Thank you. Thank you for that lovely little cinematic to prove that I just dodged that. Oh god I'm gonna die. I'm dead. Oh 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 wait I'm not dead. Okay. <laughs> this will work. Until it won't. Hi there, buddies. How you doing? Go away. Thank you. Oh no! Oh no! 
Ooh, nutty. Okay, do you guys mind? Oh my god, I'm so excited. Reload, reload, just reload, just reload. Oh no. Oh no, oh no. Oh boy. Okay. Take that. Take that. Take that. Ah! Hi there, how you doing? Hi. Wait, what? Yes. Yeah, you don't really bother me too much, to be honest. After the shit I've been dealing with. <laughs> Okay then. Flashbangs, flashbangs are your friend. There's another fucker hiding up here. Let's go. Okay. Oh, open the side door. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, Al? Is that you out there, buddy? I had to find a key to get Barry out. Yeah, it's me. Hang on. I'm okay. trying to find a key to get the door open. Okay, that's what I'm looking for right now. A key. Okay. Oh, which is right there. Okay. Hey, what's the hold up? Come on, this place is all dusty. <laughs> when attacked by a wild combine harvester, so just use flashbangs. Yeah. It's sick and tired of us using that constant window vault against the killers, that's what it is. Okay. Flashbangs are my friends. Uh, wait. Uh, I think we're gonna have to work together to open this gate, Al. Looks pretty oh. heavy. Alright. Hey! I think that's the farm on the other side of the field. We're almost there. This farm is a crazy place for crazy people. We should feel right at home then. <laughs> Come on, one more gig. Let's do this thing. Uh. Okay. Whew. Well, the lights are out. I guess we better check the fuse box. Yeah, that's the priority. Oh, that's cool. The power downstairs was out, but I was sure I could fix that at the fuse box. Can you get out of my way, buddy? I'm trying to do things here. As much as I like this flashlight, it is very, very bright and makes it hard to like see what I need to do. Stop following me, Jesus. Just, just do your own thing. Oh, that's far from. You know, this place looks kind of lived in. I thought the Andersons were in the booth. Old gods know the truth. Yeah. Okay. I don't think they keep too close an eye on them at the clinic. They seem to slip away a lot so they can get wasted. No kidding! <laughs> Those guys sound awesome. Oh. Okay. Yeah, they kind of they take the Viking thing quite seriously. Oh, there, of course, it's in the last room. I want to check. Can you hear that, Al? Music? Of course. We need to find where it's coming from. That's the message the Andersons talk about. That's the whole reason we're here. Lady of the Light? Oh, that's gotta be what's her face, the crazy lamp lady from the town. Cynthia Weaver. Right. Oh, sorry, no. Oh, 
Okay. We need to find Cynthia Weaver. We'll stay here for the night. Sorry, I misunderstood things. As soon as it gets light. The bad lady isn't hey, Al. Cynthia. Lots of hours before dawn. Cynthia's the one. Might as well lady. get some rest. And by rest, I mean drunk. Come on, Barry. This is. Yeah. Just <laughs> just get drunk in a farmhouse with rock music going. Sounds like a good night. Yeah, I love Poets of the Fall. They're amazing. I got I I found out about them through this game, and through Oggy because he loves them. And I've seen them live twice now. They're really good. God damn it! If I just wanted to, I could write ten books a year. And, and they'd be the best books that year. I wish that's how it worked. <laughs> that's right, I couldn't. But I could, because I'm a writer. What? <laughs> what do they put in this stuff? I feel like my brain is coming out of my nose. <laughs> I'm gonna get the recipe off those cooks and be a, a, a booze millionaire. <laughs> I just miss her, Barry. I just want her here with me. Uh -oh. I know. I know. So it's gonna be okay. We're gonna make it okay. I mean, if the darkness wanted to pick a moment of strike. <laughs> I love how Barry is always wearing his coat. Always. Even in the room when it's warm. Alan Wake said. Oh, oh, this is this is weird. Oh. Oh boy. drunken dream and yet it was more than that it was the truth a suppressed memory unearthed by the anderson's moonshine i was there an out-of-body observer this was the night alice and i had arrived at bright falls the night alice had disappeared i had a chance to find out alice? what had happened alice! i remembered being surprised to see the cabin dark alice would have never turned the lights off i remembered thinking I caught a glimpse of her form underwater, sinking into the darkness. <sighs> Diving after her was the last vague memory I had of that night. After that, the next thing I could remember was waking up behind the wheel of the crash car and finding the first pages of the manuscript. Beyond this lost memory, there was nothing. I had to follow the footsteps of my past self to find out what had happened that night. I couldn't find her in all that blackness. I must have thought she drowned. Jagger had Alice, Alice, and so she had me. Alice! <coughs> so for you were a, you were a book in a week. I've been easy prey. Is there someone in the window? Alice? I wish I could write a book in one week. Maybe she didn't drown after You're playing Alan for the rest of the day. Uh, I was planning on it, yeah. Alice! Yes. The dark presence had touched me. She had done or at least until my brain and used I can't me. keep doing it anymore. Go back to the cabin. All right. Oh, there we go. She must be here somewhere. Maybe upstairs in the study. Alice. Yes, that's where she is. You can apologize. Alice. You laugh at the whole thing together and put it behind you. Alice. She's not here. You were foolish to think so. No, she's dead. She drowned. No, no, no! It's your fault your wife is dead. You are guilty. All she wanted was to help you write. You killed her. Ah! Oh, hush. There's still hope. Cauldron Lake is a special place. Here, you have the power to change things. She wanted you to write. I will tell you what to do. 
Don't do it. I mean, you did it anyway. But don't do it. You can write her back. The story will come true, and all will be well again. She had Alice, and the manuscript was the ransom for her. Yes. All right. I'll fix it. I'll bring her back. Alex, now here's what I prepared earlier. Oh god, fan fiction. No. I, I refuse. In the dark. Is it near the end? Uh this is almost a complete We're near the end of episode 4 right now. And there's seven episodes altogether. Spring in my ear, making sure that the unfolding story would make her more and more powerful. I thought I was saving Alice. So we're looking at about Even with the three, four hours left. Head, some I think. Me have been aware enough to write my escape into the story, to bring a light into the cabin to release me before I could finish, to interrupt the horror story before the ending, where darkness consumed everything and everyone. Zeng was weak and far away, but I had written him into the story, and his light had been enough to set me free. It is the here now. I am here because it was written. I brought the light to set you free. You must hurry. You will know I am here. It will be back soon. It stole the skin of my Barbara a long time ago. She looks so old. Sorry, Barbara. Yeah, I'm right. It was. It was. His wife that she stole the skin of, yeah. I'm just mixing up all my names. I had woken up, confused and groggy, my mind consumed by darkness and fear. All I could do was to escape. The week spent in the cabin had taken its toll. I was barely conscious, and fading fast. It had to have cost Zane terribly. Is there fan fiction? I have no idea if there's fan fiction of Alan Wake. I'm pr there probably is. But he had managed to weaken the dark presence. Oh, are you asking if I've written fan fiction? No, I've never written fan fiction. Is like to grow strong when you did my daylight fan fiction. Oh no. Oh god. Dead by Daylight fan fiction does exist. I've not read any of it, but I know it's there. James Joyce, it's your fault, and you're gonna pay for it. Oh look! Mad guy with the guns back. 